Hello to everyone. How are you tonight? This is Joanna and it is a little bit after 9.30 and I am here with a haul from Bath and Body Works. As if nobody probably already knew that. So I went back out there today because today the aromatherapy line was $4.95 for all pieces. As far as I know, the scrubs, the oils, the um, shower gels, the creams, the lotions, the whole line. And it was definitely picked over by the time I got there since I had to go after work. And tomorrow, the wallflower bulbs are $2.95. And I may or may not go, not because I don't want to, but because I have a lot of the bulbs that I want except for repeats. If I can go out there and I don't need a coupon code because I have to battle with them over these coupon codes, I just call customer service and they give it to me. If I have to do that tomorrow, I may because I do want more of the peppermint brownie and the cake pop. I really feel like the cake pop may be red velvet. Um, like they didn't bring that out. Someone said it failed test. I really feel like it's very similar to their red velvet or what I felt their red velvet cake candle should have been. So tonight, what I did was I went out there. This was a free item in the Star Shower Gel. And then I got a spiced gingerbread candle. And I smelled the other one to compare. And I chose this one. And I was going to get the toffee brittle. Because that is the last, I believe, of the sweater looking candles that I needed to get. But it's something about it reminded me of copper coconut. And I heard someone say that. I do still want it, but I got this one instead. This is vanilla icing, cinnamon sugar, and fresh ground nutmeg. And this smells more along the lines of what the original pocket bag for gingerbread smelled like last year. Still not as strong, but more similar. Then my free item was this In The Stars wash because I used the In The Stars coupon. And this just says, it's your time to shine. Make every moment glow with an addictive fragrance that radiates from start to finish like the stars above. Everyone knows the key notes in this is starflower, sandalwood musk, sugar tangelo, white argarwood, and radiant amber. I don't care what they say, this reminds me of something. It sort of reminds me of my Italian citrus sun and my pure paradise together, but nonetheless, I am pleased with everything I purchased tonight. So I'm going to show you everything else that I bought. I did two transactions, well, I did one. This one that I just showed was a separate one, and then everything else I bought together but what I'm trying to say that's not coming out right is I did the aromatherapy and then I did a buy three get three and then I did my other little transactions that I was going to do and I'm going to share all of that with you and the coupons that are being given out right now that you will get is this free gift up to $16.50 so those of us that aren't getting the app perks this is a really nice perk. I don't believe they've given out a coupon like this before, at least not to us. It says free gift with any $10 purchase up to a $16.50 value. And it says while supplies last. It says exclusions apply. And it says valid in store. So... Let's see here. I don't know if it's, it says it excludes accessories, gift sets, and products regularly priced above $16.50. So, I don't know if that means that we can't get like wallflowers, the wallflower plugs I'm trying to say. I'll find out more about this when I go in the store tomorrow. But it does not say that you are limited to body care only. I do know that you can probably get a crate with this. I'm going to have to look and see what they're calling accessories. They never give their gift sets out in anything. And as far as anything else, I don't know. But it's a nice coupon to get. So, I was going to get for my friend Pat the Patchouli Comfort in Vanilla um, Aromatherapy. But then by the time I called her, she changed her mind and decided that she she said i was going to try another one the love now i mentioned the love when we were in there and i ended up getting some other stuff and she had to leave and that was a day that i had to battle them for a coupon so what i actually got was two of these one will be for her and one will be for me 
And then I got her a pillow mist, and I did tell her that if she wants to exchange it, she can. And then I got two of these love creams because I wanted to try this out. I'm not sure. Um, I think I like authentic rose scents. I love pink rose scents, and I love lavender rose scents. Um, but I did want to try this nonetheless because I kept saying I wanted to try this, and I did get the candle, and that was because I saw... Um, Miss Myra and Kyla with it and I wanted to try it and I got one so I thought I would try this out I also have the cranberry rose and a wild apple and rose I haven't tried any of that out yet but I did want to give this a try and I do like the smell of this and it's the closest to a rose scent they've had that I know of so that was for her and then my buy three get three I think one of the items that I wanted to get turned out not to be a part of the buy three, get three, and you guys already know, that was that box for In the Stars, a little bath box. So what I actually got here was I bought the Sparkling Night Scrub, and this is a dry scrub, I'm thinking, according to them, you get in the shower with it. And I can't tell if that's a fingerprint in there or what. I hope it's not because I picked this up from the middle. And usually stuff isn't metal within Bath & Body Works. But I'm going to keep this because the first one that they were trying to give me had the stuff hanging out of the top of it. So I guess people have been in there meddling. But this doesn't really say how to use it. It just says glow dust scrub. Our glow dust scrub buffs away dry skin while leaving an iridescent sheen. That's all it says. And they said that you get in the shower, you put this on. So I don't really know. And I haven't tried it out yet. And I am still looking at reviews on this. And the only clear review that I've seen is Queen of the Girl Geeks, where she actually demos this on her hand. But it does leave an iridescent sheen. So the next two items that I got, and they probably charge me for them in the highest price order. So that's the order I will show them to you in. Since this right here was $18.50, and it appears everything else I got was $16.50. So I got two of these in the star scrubs, and I only need one. So this is going elsewhere. And then for my free items, I got this. My daughter will like this, but she's not in town. This is the Shimmer Fizz. So she likes this right here, and I may get another one, but they were almost sold out of these tonight. These are $16.50, so I did go ahead and get this. And this says, Twisted Peppermint, celebrate the sweetness of the season with a twist of peppermint candies. Fragrant notes, cool peppermint, sugared snow, vanilla buttercream, and fresh balsam. I don't know that I've ever seen balsam in here before, but I mean, it does smell really nice, and we all know what it smells like. And it says the same thing on this. Now, this is the Funfetti that I saw Queen of the Girl Geeks with. I did get this in vanilla because I didn't want it in Winter, can winter Candy Apple. Um, did I get a Winter Candy Apple product? Besides the hand gel so far, no. I do want the candle. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I didn't see the Coconut Snowball or the Winter Candy Apple candle in there. But I did still see the Twisted Peppermint. But I do want those in the candle. But I went ahead and got this in this form because they didn't have this when I was in there before. And they said it was only going to be in these three. I'm still hoping it was a mistake and that they will make it in this fragrance and the gingerbread. If they do, I will get both of those. But this is the Funfetti. And she demonstrated this also. And this is just so pretty. I think this is even prettier than the green one. So, of course, I just showed you the third item that I got was the Frosted Coconut Snowball Butter. I do have the spray. I do have the cream. I also have a mini spray, but I might have given it away when I got the larger one. And I'm not sure if I ever had the shower gel or not. I was trying to find some stuff, and I'm thinking I might have packed that away. So, I did go ahead and I got this. And this smells really, really nice. So, as far as butters... I have this one in the Twisted Peppermint because the only other butters that I had were my original ones besides the one for the Cocoa Mint Drop. 
So we're gonna pause for a minute and I'm gonna show you the rest of the stuff I got, which is very little. I've got my hot chocolate, so I forgot two things. One, the first purchase was just $13.86. My second purchase was $118.18. And I forgot that I picked up a pillow mist for myself in the lavender vanilla. Because I had these items held and then when my friend decided that she did not want the vanilla patchouli, I had to go in there and rearrange some stuff. But I did want this for myself because I had this held. I've been wanting to try their pillow mist. I hear so much about it. And then the other items that I got which were these right here. Um, I saw these on my way out and thought they were the gold ones like the one on my purse, the last haul that I did, but all I saw was the black one. And then I got online today and I saw this gold one. And what these are are little card holders. And these are $7.75 a piece. I wish they would have been about a dollar or two cheaper. They probably will be once the holidays are over. But these are little bitty card holders that you can put your little card in, your little ID, I would say your ID, your gift card, credit card, and you put your little pocket back on there and you can put some keys on here. My daughter uses this kind of stuff for her car keys, any of the little chunky and bulky um, holders. But this is really, really cute. And let me see, do I have a pocket back over here? Well, yeah, I do. I've got this whole big gigantic crate over here that I seem to be forgetting. So you just put your pocket back in here like so. And there you go. And the last item I got that I almost was heartbroken that they didn't have was this. Another one of my limitless items. Um, every other pocket back, I'm sorry, I keep calling these pocket bags. Every other wallflower plug holder that I want is um i think 22.50 18.50 16.50 and the one special one is 29.50 i'm gonna have to have a coupon for that one because i ain't doing that plus they die and here's the thing most of these that range the 12 and 14 mark 12 and 12.50 and 14.50 when these don't give off scent you can exchange them all these ones that are sitting at $22.50, $29.50, $18.50, if they don't have any more when these die, then you get the next highest one um, up. But if you want another special one like this, I don't know. So this one right here was $14.50. And I'm glad because I thought it was priced higher. So I had to get this. And I don't know if you can see that. And it's a night light. I don't know what parts light up. Now, I do still want the ballerina one, and I do still want the one with the red truck. That house one, I'm not sure of yet, because when that thing dies, if their most expensive one is $14.50, that's your only choice. And if it's a night light, they'll give you a night light, and this is a night light. So I believe this is all that I got. So the rest of what I got was from the uniform store. So I'm going to put some of this back in here because I needed some jackets and I didn't get any. And what I got was not super exciting. In fact, the most exciting thing that I purchased was the socks. What I got was another pair of pants, um, just like what I got on. So, and I have a shirt that goes with this. And then I like these long sleeve tees and I usually get an odd color. Because where I work at now, you have to wear certain uniforms, you know, and the only thing I can control is what I wear underneath it. But even they want you to have on, I think they said a black, a black top underneath your uniform, like I got on this blue one. But I'm not doing that because most of the time I have on a jacket anyway. And if the only thing I can control with my uniform is the undershirt, I'm going to wear what I want. I'm going to get a lime green one that doesn't match this at all, but I'm going to wear it with it. And I plan on getting a black one and a gray one. And then they have the cancer ones out, but the cancer stuff is on the front, so nobody will see that. But they're long sleeve tees, and I always get something cancer when I can. So, like I said, my most exciting thing were my compression socks. And two of these are cancer socks, so I'm just going to share the prints with you. 
This one right here, you can tell clear as a bell was a cancer one. This one right here is a cancer one. And then the other two are just socks. And as you can tell, these two clearly don't go with my uniform, but I'm gonna wear them because again, if all I can control is my socks and my little under long sleeve tees, that's fine with me. Some of these are by Wonder Wink, and these are by, I don't know who these are by. Is that Lyrica, Lyrica? I'm so used to looking at the medicine Lyrica, I call everything Lyrica, but it looks like this is actually Lycra. But that was it, I just wanted to share that, and if you get any of the items, if you get this little cute little keychain thing, let me know what you think about it. I am going to go back and get some more of these and the um, solid little cherry holder that I saw on Miss Myra and Kyla's channel. And like I said, I'm going to get the tote, the wine colored tote. And if you don't know, because someone told me that they didn't know, but they're the someone that copies my information. If you get the tote and you don't like everything that is inside of that tote, you can exchange those products out like item for like item. For example, in that tote comes in the star spray. I already have one, so I will exchange that for whatever spray is in the store on that day. I don't know what the pricing of those totes will be, but they always show up around Black Friday. If they have a special blanket this year, I plan to purchase that. And I don't know if it'll be that gingham or not. But I'm going to go ahead and get off of here and go to bed because I'm super tired and I'm probably rambling. Just wanted to share with you guys what I picked up tonight. So until the next time, everyone have a great night. And please, please have as safe as upcoming time for these holidays as you possibly can. Because I know we can't control that. Blessings to all.